welcome back ladies and gentlemen I am cyanide games and this is the devil in me hey we are back where we hey, live when we wrap I'd like to take a couple weeks off go see my family I need you in post I really appreciate that discerning eye of yours you know. I got a lot going on at the moment Charlie oh right yeah of course sure take a couple of weeks get your head together I appreciate it I'll be finding post on that. You should do the same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well. Hold on, I'm gonna... Turn subtitles up. Mrs. Bonnet, you got hiding in some Pause closet. Real quick. But we just left off for them entering the, the cave marriage and trying to find a way to the uh, lighthouse. How's that marriage working out? Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. <laughs> Married to the job. Well, like, like I said in the last, in the first episode of this, this game takes, this game is pretty much about the serial killer H. H. Holmes who had the murder castle in Chicago. Come on, squeeze. Oh, there you go. Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know, just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum display or something. Right. That's probably it. And the film crew that had the uh, student documentary on H.H. H. Holmes just hired a phone call about some... from someone that has a whole bunch of uh, artifacts from it. Coming. Yeah. Just looking at the light on the mist. How is that gonna fit into the show? It just caught my eye. Coming. Always the photographer. I can't exactly turn it off. There's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Hmm. You sure about that? Because crossover with Kate hasn't exactly. We agreed to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. I'll find something to cut Lock tight. Come on, there must be another way. You sure? No, I'm optimistic. Where we can go? Let's see what's <laughs> this way, like what? <laughs> I want to do a lot of exploring in this game. That's what that's locked too. Cool. I'm doing something wrong. Oh, there you go. Ah, there you go. Four, four, ten, two thousand. Keep it up, team. This should be the final week. Last night's foghorn test.
from what I've gathered reading it, it like, sounds like there was another team up here. This thing hasn't been manned in ages. Why's the horn still going? Because they didn't decommission the fog. It's all automatic now. the lighthouse. I don't like this one bit. A stranger calling us to come in uh, to an undisclosed location. <laughs> That's even worse as we have to leave the phones in the limo. Old. What's that? Oh, Just some old coin. By the penny, get up. Look, sorry I give you a hard time now and again, but I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's not true. I may be driving this car. What car? The Lonnie Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. It's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. I get it. Oh, let's read this guy. Though. A little breaking and entering. How are you not in jail? <laughs> I think so. I don't know ex exactly where we're going, where everyone's going in this. Christ, what the hell is that? Nice to meet you too. Gonna cause that boat to crash. And I don't know if that's 
good. Or... Just need some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. You hate to see that. Um, I'm just Charlie, gonna... I'm getting an uneasy feeling. What in about God's this. name is somebody has a taxidermy hobby? Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. Ah! It moved. What? The thing. It moved. It's all gonna be okay. Look at this. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. Look, it's all right. Come on. We better get back. Is that him? I don't know. We just had the one call. Uh, how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, OK? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Demet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin, Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Again, I really can't thank you enough for this opportunity. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that? Um... Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Sure. I don't trust this. See, if I had a phone call about a show that we're doing, but I don't know how they know we're doing it, if that makes any sense, I wouldn't be going to this mysterious place from Strange Mysterious Call. So now with Dark Pitch Synthology, after this game, there's two more I'm gonna play. So I played the Man of Medan one already. So the next two it will be the House of Ash and Little Hope. But I got some more games I wanna play. I'm going to try to do more consistent videos too, because if you go to my channel and all, even though I don't have that much subscribers, you're, you're going to notice get up to the I hotel. start games, but then Please, I just stop. Stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No, of course not. You sure? Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe, but we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt, so please take care. Looks like things have buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Slow, deep breaths, Charles. Try not to cough up a diseased lung. I'll be fine. Just pretend there's a carton of smokes at the top of the hill. You're right. He takes his security very seriously. I wonder what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Just saying. I, you watch too I many like that movies. answer. He values his privacy. We've known that right from the start. We've known that for about 
two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I want to grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, OK? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm a very private person. Don't worry, Mr. Dumet. Discretion is Lonnie Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. OK, let's go for a technique. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. OK, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas? This way. You'll steal some more shots, right? Obviously. I have a feeling he knows inside that or he's behind it. See, I don't fucking trust this for the simple. Mr. Dumet is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to get a look around without him knowing. Matt is entitled to his privacy. He's cagey. I want to know what he's trying to hide. What? do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Ah, oh, oh, oh my, damn it. What happened? You okay? Oh. Did you get your baby ego again? We should get her up to the hotel. Oh my, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up in Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. Wait, hotel. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah, yeah. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because... I'm charming, and you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Oh, this is not gonna be f no. Yeah, explore the island. So I'm playing this. So I'm Kate. The other chick, the other girl is doing. I'm gonna do a quick pause of this. Actually, I'm gonna keep playing. But I really don't like this for the hey, simple. Can I ask you something and get a straight answer? You know, you know, you making a smart ass reply or taking a shot at me. That works both ways. Fine. Well, tell me the truth. Is there any saving this show? Maybe. If there's some sort of magical holy grail of footage or information to be had here. You think that's likely? No. At best, we'll get some nice B-roll. That's not gonna save our asses. Nice. Like I said, I know a little bit about this game, so I know what's to come, but I don't know when and how. It's a bit of a scramble. back really quick.
And there's a sound. But I am back though. It's part I can't go in there, GOC. Come on, James. He could have told us to dress for a trek. <laughs> Try not to fall and die. I don't want to see Mark cry. Thanks for the concern. Really. Wonder where this goes. It's straight up and down the hill. Yeah. But what's on the other end? here on this island Shh. get down with your family my wife is she died oh shit sorry i didn't mean to be rude come on we're about there they didn't see us let's go this is ridiculous there's nothing out here Over there. Oh, I came again inside the house. Well, not the house, but the building. Oh my. Uh, Jesus! I heard you were looking for a new place. Not sure I can afford those. So it's Jamie finding a body and turning it around. I'm gonna turn it to Cruise 20. Looks like Dumet has a family. Someone's watching us. Maybe this is the way. If I wanted to go on nature hikes, I wouldn't have moved to the city. This shit is not in my job description. But 
we can go to this one, no, but we don't know. Reminds me of shit summer camps. Get the car moving and stop it here. We'll be able to get across. See the control panel? It's trashed. I don't even think there's power. Maybe we can get this thing working. Jamie, can you fix this? Yeah, my name is Jamie now. I got it. So far, I got two. What's through here? Hear that? Hello. I pushed out two. You are. He's gonna alert them. Uh, 
Alright, let's go up here. I think the I think if he kept going down he would have actually unlocked those two doors. Hey Oh Oh god, that's so much better. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. I found a shortcut up the hill. I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Dumet. We're all here now. Let's head on. Everyone stay under the watchful eye of Mr. Dumet, please. Kate. What do you think? A summer camp from hell. Whatever. We're gonna find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Don't worry about that. Coming or what? Uh huh. You afraid of heights? Maybe. Yes. Oh shit! We're all gonna die! Just go. <laughs> oh my god, relax, Mark. Oh, that serious drop. You good? Oh, man. You can do it. Eyes forward. Don't look down. I got it. It's fine. Is it, though? I shouldn't have looked. It's just water down there. You can swim. Besides, the bridge looks dependable. Ish. Come on. I'll help. That's it. Look, it's fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't look down. Yeah. <laughs> See? Not so bad. <sighs> Thank you. You always knew how to get me through the shit, didn't you? We should catch up to Mr. Dumet. Where is everyone? Apologies, uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. That's the hotel we're staying at. I'm just gonna say this, I don't trust that hotel because if this is... This, wow. Mr. Dumet, this place is uh, magnificent. I do yeah. have a fit. Maybe this won't be a waste of a weekend. I do have a feeling that hotel is gonna have a whole bunch of traps. I wonder who you are. What are you doing? I I saw a little girl. Up there. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. You are such a dick. Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. Look at this. It's amazing. This is intense. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Uh, this isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll no, make sure it's it not. Your rooms. It's been it's tossed over the cliff. Erin, cigarettes. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. Eddie. 
Mr. Dumet, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? They said they were going to go to a you. place with certain artifacts, but they didn't know it was going to be at this. I don't think they know it's at this hotel. So I have a feeling this is going to be based on H.H. Holmes and throwing a lot of Psycho with Norman Bates. This is my dog. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. She do not know. You're jumpy. Oh my god. See, I'm sure she was going I think on. I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? I was. I don't think we're the only ones here. Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw, a little girl. Mr. Demet probably has family, a staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. It's, um, it's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. <laughs> Doesn't really work. I bet. 181. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. 183? This is me. Okay. Okay. Good luck out there. Don't get lost. Scream if you need me for anything. Thanks. I got you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes, thanks. I'd end up lost, probably. It's, it's just a hall, dude. A hall that probably changes. Changes under stress. And traps. here we are. Well, it's, um, cozy? Let's just be playful. Mm, cozy is fun. If we have to double up like last time, we'd be married by morning. You talk in your sleep. Not sure I ever told you that. Sure? What did I say? Actually, it was just a bunch of incoherent swearing. Oh. I was awake. I was reading Kate's social media posts. Ugh, that bitch. Okay, don't hate me. But she's been kind of nice to me. I mean, I think she's more upset about Mark than she lets on. Lies. She's a robot. Uh, where's the bathroom? Wait, what? Old school. Ah, uh, gross school. What do I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I gonna walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's no mini bar either. Huh? Shows what you know. What is that? Wine, genius. Oh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out and lecture me and make me feel like an asshole again. Yeah, he does that. But we're not on the clock. Doesn't throw a rig into shoe. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not suggesting we get full on hammered before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Also, you're cute when you're worked up. I don't, cute? You think I'm cute? Hmm? Oh. That's You're me. so clumsy. What would Charlie say? Oh, I know. 
Where'd it go? Uh... It's uh, all the way against the wall. See it? <coughs> you okay? <coughs> Shit. <coughs> you trying to scare me now? <coughs> no. Revenge? Because good job. <laughs> oh, that's my turn. You sure you're okay? Because, yeah, maybe me scaring you didn't help, did it? No. But seriously, it's not your fault. I just, I... I try to pretend like it isn't a thing, you know? I, like, I don't want to be depending on an inhaler. I try to mind over matter it, but... Dust and allergies and... I just need to be more careful. You sure? Sure. I'm sure. So, uh, yeah. Cozy. <laughs> you gonna try that? And now you're poisoned. It's not that bad. You're not lying? It's piquant. Decent vintage. Sure. I'm getting... Oaky undertones, a hint of citrus. Oh. And I want to say a strong, healthy amount of moldy sweat socks. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> I hate you. You are such a liar. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the thinking you were a cute thing. Really? Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine. Not because I am bashful. I swear. Really. Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. I, uh, yeah, it's just... We work together, and Charlie is always on me about being more professional, and... I get it. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Erin. Or that I don't think you're cute, too. It's just, um... We're gonna move in. Do it. What are you doing? I, oh, my God. I, uh... I... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you bitch! I'm just fucking with you. I wanted to kiss you for months. I just was scared to make a real move. Sorry, sorry. Who is that? They were being watched, I bet you. Well, they were, because we saw it uh, POV from behind a mirror. And we know with that mirror, it's a two way, uh. <sighs> Enjoying yourself out here like some sort of pervert? Sorry, did I, uh, interrupt something here? No, we're just talking shop. We're worried about the power grid handling all of our gear. Yeah, yes. If this place is running on a generator, we need to know what it's putting out. I don't care what you guys are doing. Then why are you lurking? I can't find my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> These funny shapes are numbers. They go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, then we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can't we plan after dinner? I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. You've got ten minutes. Okay. God, he's a dead. We'll be down in a few then. Time to have a little quickie. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue bag. No cigarettes. That's where I put them. Come and show me. Maybe one of us is colorblind and doesn't know what a blue bag is. <sighs> to be continued, then? Yes. Definitely. Dad, Charlie's a fucking dick. 
You know how I said I'm going to try and keep Good most, most people alive in this? I might not keep Charlie alive. I might just let him just freaking get it. <laughs> Charlie might not be having a free show, but someone else was behind that mirror. Come on, come on, let's go. Let's go. Where the hell are they going? I really think Dumont knows what's going he knows what's going on and that might be his daughter which we saw in that family photo. This might be a long episode, so I'm playing as Charlie now. Well, I'm looking. Oh, Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls, navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress, or... Absolutely not. I'm not stressed, okay? Do I look fucking stressed? Uh, that was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh, yeah. Embossing makes a huge difference. You old guys love business cards. <laughs> old school. You old school guys. I also put it on heavy stock and did the logo in foil. Damn. I should have had one ready for Mr. Dumet. Did you find them? I... No. I swear I put them in here. I don't understand. <sighs> Jesus. Look, stop tearing around in there like a maniac. Be organized about it. Methodical. Blue bag, front pocket. I made a specific mental note of it. They're gone, Charlie. Gone? Just like that? Are you saying somebody took them? I... I don't... Actually, I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. It's fine. Let's just get on with things. This place is massive. Surely there is a pack of cigarettes in here somewhere. Even if they're ancient... You need them that bad? There was a bar off the lobby. There must be cigarettes in the bar, right? I mean, technically, it's not legal to smoke in bars, so... Come on, we're checking. If you find them first, all will be forgiven. Okay, so I'm ending off this episode here. And alright, I'm getting out of the... Oh, man, since I started playing this game, I had a bad feeling about where this is going. Sorry, I was looking at my camera for a moment. I noticed it's we're not out of focusing. But since you're actually in this hotel, I have a weird feeling. Plus, the guy in the yellow trunk, in the raincoat coming in, and the old woman in the chair talking gave me a bit of Norman Bates vibes a lot. For the simple fact is, you hear the old woman talking, but you don't see her talking. Plus, if that's the same man doing the mannequins. That makes it ten times more creepier. But I am very interested in this game. I'm actually excited to play more. So, but, but I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to... See you on next episode. If you like what you see, hit like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next episode.